We felt pretty positive about the way things are going. Uh, fortunately, haven't really had any injuries other than two guys uh, that basically hurt themselves in warm-up. But uh, overall, uh, really accomplished everything I wanted to get done. Uh, get our young people a lot of work, stay off a lot of contact. Uh, even though we've people have seen practices, they, very hard practices, very high tempo. And we get after it some on 11 on 11. But uh, when you don't put shoulder pads on, you're, you're, you're laying off the contact. People talk about contact practices being, you know, tackling and scrimmaging and tackling to the ground. As soon as you put helmets and shoulder pads on, even though you still have gym shorts, uh, that's a contact practice for the inside seven on seven guys. And they're going to be, you know, whacking each other away when you lack the depth as we do. Next thing you know, you've got another set of injuries from spring. And I just felt that, uh, you know, it just wasn't worth it in 15 spring practices. Now, when we get to preseason camp, it'll be business as usual and a lot more hitting and a lot more scrimmaging and a lot fewer days, consecutive days without a day off. There'll be the one adjustment that I'm going to make uh, this uh, preseason. But uh, we do feel good about where we're at right now and uh, great weather today. And the uh, guys are out here having fun the last two, one of uh, two practices. Yeah, we've had a couple of staff changes. We're going to yet have another one. Uh, we had a couple new guys. Joe DiMattia was our operations uh, director, and now he's moved up to that defensive spot, replacing Coach Parker. And Shane Ferguson comes to us from Mary Mack, and he's basically replaced him as a wide receiver coach, Tim working with tight ends. But uh, Luke Charlenzio is going to be joining us, uh, uh, coaching the tight ends and working with Coach Clayton in the O-line. So uh, staff's, uh, staff's all intact, unless there's something I don't know. Well, I think some of our young people have really stepped up the move of uh, C.J. Emil to tailback. I think is a big move, putting the ball uh, more times in his hands. We tried to, you know, identify the playmakers, and we've got a few spread all over the place. Uh, Dylan Wadsworth, just really most athletic tight end I think we've ever had. Group of wide receivers out there making plays. So the, the idea offensively is to let's get the ball in the hands of the playmakers and let them make plays. Defensively. Uh, our young secondary get a lot of good work and uh, you know really have uh, have some high hopes for how they are able to play